Hi, this is Gage B. Gadget Hacks. Today I'm listing my five top root apps. Now, these aren't one through five in order of best to worst. I mean, these are the five must haves, in my opinion. First, let's start with Set CPU. It is $1.99 in the Android market, or free if you're a member of XDA, which I would suggest you buy the paid version because these developers work hard on these things. This allows you to control your CPU speed, set profiles, uh, so if your temperature gets too high on your battery, it'll cut the speed down. You can change it to where your screen goes off, your processor cuts down to save battery life. It's a wonderful program, especially if you want to get into overclock kernels for your phone because I can clock my G2 all the way up to almost 1.5 or down to really very minimum. I wouldn't go that low, but back to the stock 806. I run it you know, about 1.2 because it's a nice speed, but one of the must-have apps. The second would be Root Explorer because it lets you into the file system, the root file system of your Android phone. You can choose Mount Read Only or Mount Read and Write. That way do read only so you don't screw things up if you don't know what you're doing. But very handy program if you're working on hacking your phone doing things. Uh, it's 403 US in the market but very worth it if you need it. Uh, also Titanium Backup. Now this is a wonderful program. This allows you to back up all of your apps and your settings and everything like that. Like if you get a new phone and you're going to root it perfect you can put all your apps back in it. it's like you never lost anything going from phone to phone makes it very easy it also uh, makes it very easy to go from ROM to ROM if you like to switch around ROMs on your phone it's a must-have program it is 60 or excuse me sorry there's a paid version in the market for 607 which also allows you to freeze apps like uh, Amazon MP3 which comes with almost every Android phone I've ever seen and I don't know anybody who really uses it uh, it's available uh, you have the ability to freeze it with the paid app and uh, it doesn't use up resources in the background which is nice <laughs> fourth is ROM manager of course this is the uh, in phone extension of the clockwork mod recovery uh, wonderful if you like switching ROMs or even if not because it lets you back up your whole ROM and, and you know if you need to send your phone in for service and you have the ability you can back up your ROM and save to your SD card when you get your new one in root it restore your old ROM and you didn't lose anything it's different from titanium there's I mean you can't add and take things from it it backs up your ROM as a whole so two different uses kind of the same thing but different in a lot of ways once you mess around with them you'll understand why uh, and last but not least Wi-Fi tether this isn't available in the market but uh, I will include the link in uh, at the bottom of the video to get to this if you don't have tethering on your phone or hotspot and uh, you do have root this is a definite needed app I love it because I can take my laptop out with me and if I need something quickly or you know uh, my friend has iPods and touches that don't have 3G internet built in I can turn my Wi-Fi hotspot on and they can use the internet on theirs it's just a nice app to have so that's my top five root apps uh, hope you enjoy all these apps and I if you can I suggest you buy the paid version of each of these apps because they're well worth it and the developers work hard on these things thanks